What's up, YouTube? We back at it again. It's your boy, Tricity. Today, we got the Antelope Audio Zen Go tutorial. When I tell y'all this interface is amazing, like, I can't even, I can't lie to y'all, man. I got to keep it real. And this video is not sponsored at all. Like, so just to give y'all a short rundown, in April, I kept seeing ads about this interface, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to go get it. What I had was a... Focus right Scarlet 2i2. So going from that to this has been insane. Don't get me wrong. I could do some good recordings with the Scarlet, but this interface and Scarlet ain't got nothing on it. I'm not gonna lie. All right. So, you know, if what this may look a little familiar to some of y'all, like if you had like an Apollo or anything, or if you ever seen somebody using Apollo, you're used to seeing a console. All right. So you got your Synergy Core console right here, all right? Now, when you get this interface, you get two mic pre's and you get two headphone slots. So that is amazing. You also have two spit of outputs and then like four sets of monitor um, outs, which two of them are like the quarter inch cables and then the other side is like the rca I, I believe that's what they are okay all right so and this particular interface as you see is usb so you don't need um any you know power source it is strictly powered by your computer so you can take this wherever you want to go so it's literally like having a portable studio if you got this interface like <laughs> Even if you have like a lower quality microphone, this can still help you um, because you can do those real time effects, which I'm going to show y'all. You can do real time effects to go ahead and, you know, amp up the sound. All right. So down here, we got your mic pre's. Um, let's see. So you come here and this is where you put your effects. All right. So you got to. Now, depending on it, how what type of special you may have bought yours on, like when I bought it, I got like 37 free plugins. Um, see, as you can see, I don't have everything. Um, I bought, I think, what was it? It was like a vocal bundle and it came with this Neve 1073. Uh, this B, well, BAE Audio 1073 is like a Neve. Um, and then I think the five, the 55B may have came with it. And this 4K um, orange, I think that came with it as well. Then you got some some, some compressors. All right. Um, what else? I think this DO609 might have came with my my bundle as well. Um, but you have other stuff like, you know, like the impressors, like the distressor. So if you're familiar with that, you can actually buy that for this. All right. And then you got your mic pre's. Now with these mic pre's, I know the Jarotech comes with this, the RD47 comes with it, and the BA31 comes with it. Now this 1073, again, I had to buy this. Um, so that's why I have this, all right? And then if you play guitar, you're gonna have a lot of fun because you have a few amps. Like I don't know anything about playing guitar or amps, so you know, I can't really describe how these sound or what you would do with them. All right. And then you got guitar cabinets. Again, I'm not a guitar player, so I don't know about these cabinets. But if you play guitar, you're going to have fun and you also have a tuner. All right. Up here, you got like modulation. Um, So you got like vibrato flangers. And I think I had I just have the chorus and stuff right here and special processing. I'm not really sure what this does. I haven't messed with it. All right. So. Now it comes, I think this is an EQ. I can't remember what, what it was this one. Yeah, this is a compressor. All right, that's a compressor. Um, and then you got this. I think this is like a noise gate. So I'm using a noise gate in, in Pro Tools. Let me close this out. Let me turn this off. Close it out. Oh yeah, let me show y'all again. Like I had this and then you can just either, you can hit bypass to turn it off. Well, I'm gonna take the extra, take it completely off the insert. All right. So in Pro Tools, as you can see, my vocals 
are going to my it's going into my microphone track as y'all see that goes to record track which is going to my video talk aux there's nothing on here so you're hearing a raw sound the only thing that's here is this noise gate to clean up the background other than that there's no eqs no compressors right now so this is like a raw sound all right now also you got your computer play you see you see one and two here like to as i'm talking these meters are moving um now i'm finna show y'all something real neat right so you can actually change all of this stuff around if you want to so watch this All right, so y'all like atrocity, what you do that for? All right, so the reason I did that is because what I can see, you only have four slots to use inserts on. All right, so I can use some of mic pre one, mic pre two, and then right here on three and four, I can use some. So if I put like, let's just say I put a compressor here. Uh, Let's do this. All right. All right. So I got this compressor here. Now, what I can do with so this is on three and four. What I can do is use this as an insert in my my in Pro Tools, right? So if I move this out, let's see. I'm gonna close this. Well, now I'm gonna keep it open. All right. Now y'all see right here where the sins is, right? You go to output three and four. All right. Now, let's go back to here, all right? So, now this plugin will get used on my record track as an insert. So, I'm gonna turn, so it's down right now. I'm going to turn it up. Let me go back where we at. All right. So, now you see as I'm talking, this is moving too. All right. So, we're going to turn this up. Now, you hear the compressor working. See the compressor? Yeah. Yeah. See the compressor working now, right? So I'm actually using, I was just using compression for my interface. All right. So that's cool. So you'll come to sends. And then again, I went to my output. I put it on three or four, just like it's on my interface. Crazy. So, oh, we opened up OBS for. All right. Now, I'm going to take this back off, but that's why I switched that around. So if y'all, so y'all can see that if you have this, try it out. You know, it's crazy. All right. Now down here, you got your monitor volume. So this would be like your speakers. So you can dim them, you can mute them. Um, You can turn them up and down right here. Right here is for headphones one. You got dim and mute. The volume's right there. Now also... It comes with your other headphones, so you can create a separate mix for headphones too. So you don't need an audio splitter if it's just you and the artist. Crazy. I I know my Scarlet did not have that for sure. <laughs> I now before we get into these effects, I'm gonna show y'all you if you're someone who use spit of, you have two spit of um ends that you can use for I guess for you know, um, what is it, extra outs or ins? I'm look, I'm not sure. I don't use the spittles part. All right. So that's something you have to do on your own. I'm strictly just recording. All right. Boom. So now you come to your DAW IOs. This is where the magic is happening. You feel me? Now, so you got record one and two, which is your mic pre's. Okay. So like when you go to your your DAW and you put it on. Or if it's like input one, that's what record one is. And then input two would be record two, three, four, five, six, so on. All right. Now, five, six is record five and six. But in your DAW, it's going to be output one and two. So you do that. All right. Now, right here, y'all like, what is this? Now, normally this doesn't come loaded on to your interface. You have to change this. And... If you're somebody like me that got Windows, this is going to change everything for you. If you are recording videos or streaming, 
this interface actually allows you to, to route the sound so that your interface can feed it into OBS. So you don't have to download voice meter or um, Odeus or anything. You don't need any extra software besides OBS because this interface makes it easier for you. So right here, it's on loopback. So you go here to loopback headphone one, boom. Come back here, loopback headphone two. Now you got a stereo sound. Just to show y'all when I go into OBS, we go into settings, audio. Now you see my mic auxiliary is going to seven and eight. So everything that's getting recorded in Pro Tools, right, is going to one and two. All right, so one and two is getting fed into seven and eight right here. And then seven and eight is going into OBS. So voila, you're recording all the sound that's happening on your computer. See, all right, now we finna get into the real saucy part now. So let's set up some effects. Like again, right now we're not, we don't have any effects on the voice, but a noise gate. All right, so I'm gonna show y'all what I do. Come here. I like to start with a mic pre. So we're gonna go 1073. And I like to put it on this 300, all right? Now 300, you know, it gave it like a, a bigger feel. So I'm gonna turn my, my mic pre down. All right, so I'll turn that down. Now, I got a little bit lower, but let's go to compressor. We're gonna use this one. All right, I'm gonna set like a fast attack, fast release. And we're gonna change the input. Yeah, yeah. All right, so now, you see, now my voice then got louder. So now I got a pre and I got some compression on it. So cool. Boom. So again, all of this is happening in my interface. So I'm already having a cleaner signal come through. All right. Now go to my EQ and I'm going to pull up this 4K orange, like an SSL style. If you notice where how SSL EQs look or the consoles. So now all I'm going to do on here, I'm not going to touch the EQ. For for now, um, I'm just gonna put on a high pass filter just to clean up some of that bottom end. Yeah, so now nah, it's sounding good to me. I don't know about y'all, but I like how this sounded so far. All right, now over here, you got reverb. Now this reverb is not on right now, so that's why you don't hear it. But and normally, so this is mic one right here, and normally when you get it, it'll be down here. Um, right there, but I turn it up all the way to zero. Um, but again, it's off right now. So just to talk about this reverb, this is aura verb. This effect does not get printed on your vocals. This effect is strictly for monitoring. So if someone just like, hey, give me some verb, you can give them some verb without it getting recorded. So, and it's like zero latency, so they can hear the verb in real time, they can hear it in real time, but it's not getting recorded. So, boom, now it's on. Yeah, verb. Yeah, then you got some controls. Got your color. I like turning the color up. And you got your pre delay. If I turn it up, yeah, yeah. You see how the verb come later? Yeah. Um, well, I'll put that like there. You got your early reflections. Got late reflections. Then you got your richness. Now. I, I would have to do a separate video on Aura Verb really just to show y'all like how to really shape this to how you like it. Then you got your room size. I like having a wide verb. Uh, then you got your reverb level. So you can turn it up because it's a sin. So yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I'm gonna turn it off. But yeah, so if you just wanna record, they record, hey, give me some verb, boom. Go to Aura Verb. Turn it on, and then you use this to feed it, to feed it into the headphones. All right, that's cool. So, for the most part, and then let me go right here, and then you could change your view to you got sixteen. I know you got computer, you can because you can have up to I think it's like seven and like eight eight outs, so you can have like 
Um, one and like I got one and two here, three and four. I could put like five and six, seven and eight. Then if I wanted to put like spit ups or anything else over there, I could do that there. All right. Now, here's the the part that makes this my favorite interface, right? I have the Antelope Audio Edge Solo. That's the mic y'all hearing right now. And it sounds amazing, all right? But this mic is special because it does emulation. It's a mic modeling mic. So what we're gonna do where the preamp is, I'm gonna click here, we're gonna go to emulation mic. We're gonna put it on one, we're using input one. All right, now, right now you're hearing the Edge Solo. This is what the mic sounds like, all right? Then we go to the C800, you know, it gave me a little bit more presence. I like this mic. Um, let me go to something. All right, the Shure SM7B. If you ever heard of Shure SM7B, this should sound familiar. All right. Then you got a couple of more. What's another famous mic? Um, we got the TLM103. This is most home, a lot of home studios, people. They they run to this mic because it's very good. Not gonna lie to you. I think wait, what is this mic is like? I like a band. You can get it for like a band. All right. Well, maybe like a band fifteen hundred something like that. All right. Uh, if you're lucky, you might. If you lucky, you get it like used. You might get it for like eight nine hundred. Um. All right. But for the video, I gotta rock the Berlin eighty seven, which is supposed to be like the Neumann U eighty seven. I love this mic. You know, this it's the future mic, man. This is what all them hits was recorded on. A U, you see a U87 going into a Neve 1073. Unfortunately, we don't have the tube tech like UAD does. So <sighs> come on, Antelope Audio. Talk to somebody. Soft tube. Come on. We need one. All right. So now we got the U87 going into the BAE73, going into my 1176 style compressor, all right? Going into my 4K Orange, which uh, SSL board. I think this would be like the 4000E, if I'm not mistaken. And it's just like, the only thing I don't like is it don't show you the numbers when you're rolling it. So I would say this might look be like 117 I'm rolling off. That's what I would do with the EQ and Pro Tools. So I kind of saved myself a step. All right. Um, and that's all, man. That's really it. Uh, so let's see. I'm trying to think. Nah, man, I think they got to get y'all the rundown. So now you can also save this as like a template. Um, so you can hit save and then you can save as, um, or no, nah, you know, I'm just going to go here, hit save, uh, hit save. Oh, no, nah, because I got to save to something else. So I'm going to save as, and you can pick a folder. Mine is in documents and I'm just going to name it Zengo U87 setup. All right. So then the next time you open up your Zen Go, you can hit load and then browse, and then you can come here and load it up. All right? But I'm not going to do that right now. Cool. All right. Now, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to record. I'm going to turn the aura verb on so I can hear some verb while I'm recording. Yeah. Yeah, I'm tossing, but we have fun. Yeah. Gave me a shot, I unloaded the gun. Yeah. Shot it, pull up in Australia. Whoa. But we have fun. Yeah, yeah. Gave me a shot, I unloaded the gun. Yeah, yeah. Shot it, pull up, stretch out like a lunge. Yeah. Uh, she pull up in the island. We have fun, yeah. Gave me a shot, I unloaded the gun, 
yeah, yeah. Shotty pull up, stretch her out like a lunge, yeah. She let me touch her wherever I want, yeah. We have fun, yeah. Gave me a shot, I unloaded the gun, yeah, yeah. Shotty pull up, stretch her out like a lunge, yeah, yeah. She let me touch her wherever I want, yeah. Say she loving my ex, shout it be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, bitch. I don't even know what's happening. You got my number, what's happening? I like a lunch, mm, yeah. She let me touch her wherever I want, mm, yeah, mm, yeah. You got my number, what's happening? Shout it be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, bitch. I like a lunch, yeah. She let me touch her wherever I want. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, you got my number, what's happening? Try to be loving my ex, tell her pull up, get that back, then. How do I run on the net, then? How do I run on the net, then? Mm -hmm. If I want oh, my ex, yeah, tell her pull up, get that back, then. yeah. You got my number, what's happening? Try to be loving my ex, then. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. How do I run on the net, then? How do I run on the net, then? How do I run on the net, then? You got my number, what's happening? Shout it, be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. She let me touch her wherever I want. Yeah, huh, huh. You got my number, what's happening? Shout it, be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that like a lunch. Yeah, she let me touch her wherever I want. Yeah. You got my number, what's happening? Shout it, be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. Sweat out of tracks and nasty. Sweat out of tracks and nasty. She let her bit in the smack, then. Shout it, be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it. Huh? You got my number, what's happening? Shout it, be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it. I don't want no for me, I don't know. I don't want no love. I don't want my head, I don't know. 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 Hit front of her back and I'm smacking She got it yummy, yummy, yum How that one fit in the middle of my tongue How that one, mmm, yum Tell her that restin' all over my tongue mm. Try to be loving my ex Tell her pull up, get that back, then Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it She got it, uh, that's up How that one know where the time went How that one ride on by me Try to be loving my ex Yeah, tell her pull up, get that back, then Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it Yeah, I love the way she be riding it Tell me no why we sliding it. Try to be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back. Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it. Yeah, I love the way she be riding it. Gas me for L when I slide in it. Try to be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back. Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it. Yeah, I love the way she be riding it. She take her breath when I slide in it. You got my number, what's happening? Try to be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it. Yeah, I love the way she be riding it. She take her breath when I slide in it. Mm hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm I don't know none of the way I've seen. Mm hmm, mm -hmm, I don't know how we vibing. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it. I love the way she be riding it. She take her breath when I slide in it. I don't want one like no Iverson. One of my thoughts like Iverson. Hmm, 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 Carlson. I don't have no vibing left. Hmm, my rest, we tired of it. Get rest, you know I'm tired of it. Hmm, 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 hmm. Huh. Yeah, I'm toxic, but we have fun. Yeah. Gave me a shot, I unloaded the gun. Yeah, yeah. Shot it, pull up, stretch out like a lunge. Yeah. She let me touch her wherever I want. Yeah. Huh. You got my number, what's happening? Try to be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it. I love the way she be riding it. She take her breath when I slide it in. Hit it three times like Iverson. Try to be loving my ex. Tell her pull up, get that back, then. Hit front of her back and I'm smacking it. I love the way
way she be riding it. She take a breath when I slide it in. Hit it three times like Iverson. Hey, who and when we having it? Mm-mm-mm-mm, ties in it. That's right. Turn it off. All right, man. So I hope y'all learned something. I hope y'all enjoyed. Um, Hit me up if y'all got any other questions. It's your boy Atrocity. I'm out.